Hey guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, codingphase.com. Your boy is back and out and did it again. So today we got some new news coming from Google. Okay, so they basically introducing to you guys now this new dot app domain. So basically it's a more secure home for apps on the web. So this is cool for us as developers because now we could have a dot app. Meaning, hey, if you created a social network, hey, you're creating a dating site, hey, you created a, you know, a game or whatever, right? Like literally now you can buy a dot app. And what's cool is that not everybody has this domains. So if you guys have an idea of like a game you want to build, a application you want to build, and you say, hey, man, I want to get the domain, guys, go get it now because... I'm pretty sure soon it's gonna be taking. So let's see, even the coding phase dot app, I'm pretty sure is available for now, right? So I'm gonna buy it, but you guys should definitely look into this because it is pretty cool. I like the idea of a domain for a app specifically because we're so used to uh, the word app and application and just general public already knows about the word app as soon as they hear the word app they know okay i'm gonna come in i'm gonna see either an application or it's gonna be a landing page for an application for my phone so it it, it makes sense all right now what's cool about this is that google decided to make this dot app domain mandatory to have HTTPS. Now, the reason why this is happening is because Google is trying to push this agenda to make sure that all the websites on the net is actually more secure. Okay, now, does this help completely in like your life as far as like, hey, my password is gonna be secure, the people are not gonna have to do, uh, be able to do SQL injections, people are not gonna be able to do this, this, and that. No, it doesn't help with that. <laughs> what it does is, let's say you are in a Starbucks and we're all using the same Wi-Fi. Somebody can literally go and connect to the Wi-Fi and then get all of the information of everybody meaning everybody that's connected to that Wi-Fi and they're going to a website that's not secured, they could get your credit card number, your, um, you know, whatever you put into forms, um, all your information, they can get it if the website is not secure, all right? Now, one thing that I always tell people is whenever you're going to put in your credit card or your information, you want to make sure that I'm going to show you right now, just like in codingphase.com, when you come in, you'll see that this little thing right here up here, it says secure. That means they're using HTTPS, which has a certificate, which is valid and, and pretty much is like, okay, it just lets people know that if you put in your credit card number, nobody can really take this if they are on a Wi-Fi connection. Okay. And like I said, for me, the most important thing about this is the fact that basically we're going to have a dot app, dot app. I don't know why I, I've been wanting this for a long time. I always wonder like, why don't they have a dot app? Like dot IO seems more like the technical domain for me. Like if I wanted to go to a, a website where, uh, they will talk to me about, um, a framework right i would expect it to be in a dot io but if i want to go to a social network or i want to go to a game um a website for a game right basically i would expect that to be in a dot app so this is pretty cool guys go check it out literally go to uh get that app and you will see if your domain is available you could come here and say hey um Let's say singles that app probably somebody took it. Oh shoot. Somebody is not a taken. That's hot. <laughs> All right, guys. Anyways, man, I'll see you guys later. It's your boy Joe back at it again. Codingphase.com. 
This video is brought to you by CodingFace.com and all of its members. Make sure you go visit a website. It's the only place where you're gonna learn how to become a web developer with real projects. Take it from me, it's your boy Joe, back at it again. CodingFace.com, keep it real, keep it trill.